This is an audiovisual representation of a study published in the Journal of Bone and Joint Surgery in 2018. Total knee arthroplasty, or TKA, is one of the most common orthopedic procedures used to treat advanced knee osteoarthritis. TKAs are increasingly being performed on younger and more active patients, who in turn often expect to return to their normal activity levels following surgery. A group of researchers from the Rothman Institute at Thomas Jefferson University and the Hospital for Special Surgery performed a study to determine the impact of patients' physical activity levels on their preoperative expectations, postoperative satisfaction, and clinical outcomes following TKA. They retrospectively reviewed cases of patients who underwent a primary unilateral TKA between 2007 to 2012. A survey tool was used to categorize the patients on the basis of their activity levels. With an equal number of patients in each group, the active group was matched to the inactive group by age, sex, body mass index, and comorbidities. Although a significant number of patients in the active group had a higher expectation of returning to normal activity, 35% of these patients decreased their activity level two years after surgery. Interestingly, during the same time period, 70% of the inactive group had increased their activity level compared with their baseline levels. Moreover, revision rates at 5 to 10 years after surgery were significantly higher for the active group when compared with the inactive group, despite both groups demonstrating similar postoperative complication rates. These results demonstrate that only inactive patients who underwent TKA achieved improvement in physical activity level from their preoperative baseline, while the majority of active patients did not increase their activity level. Further, active patients experienced an elevated rate of revision surgery in comparison to inactive patients. Thus, active patients looking to treat osteoarthritic knee pain with a TKA to increase their activity levels should be counseled about these limitations.